Hey guys, what's up? Mike Piano Man here, and I'm going to give you a brief tutorial on how to blur out someone's face using Final Cut Express. So here we go. You're going to start off by uh, just right away opening up the application. Now as you can see, I've already drug a uh, short clip onto my timeline. And on this clip, I've got two of my buddies there, and I'm going to blur out the one on the right. So I'm going to remove his face. So to do this, you're going to select your clip and then go to the top where it says Effects, Video Filters, and select Mate. Once you get there, you're going to go about halfway down and it'll say Mask Shape. You're going to select that. Now as you can see right here, you've got a rectangle going on around these people. You're going to go ahead and change the shape to an oval where the Shape tab is located. So you're just going to go up. Now what you have is you have a nice oval that you can mess around with. So you're going to start off by changing the center point. So it's around just the person's face that you want to blur. So you can distort the least amount of image apart from that person's face. So you're going to go ahead and slide it so it's adjusted quite nicely to your uh, the face that you're trying to blur out. So I'm going to see if I can do a half decent job real quickly doing this for you guys. And um, all right, that's that should be. That should be about good enough. So now what we're going to do is we're going to add a second filter. So you're going to go back up to your effects tab. And uh, let's see. Yeah, it is, it is a little rough, but that's fine. So you're going to go back up to your uh, effects tab. And from there, you're actually going to just go blur and your basic channel blur. Now what you can do is at the top, you've got that slider with your amount. Typically, you're going to want to adjust it so that you don't have a crazy blur that just looks weird in your video. You want to keep it so you can't tell the person's face, but you still know that it's a face there and it's not something really messed up like a bird on someone's shoulder. So what you're going to do now is you just duplicate that. So by holding Option, Shift, and dragging the clip up, you will duplicate both of those clips. And with those duplicated clips, they also hold the same attributes. So you're going to go down to the bottom click, and you're just going to delete all of the attributes and filters that you added to it. Now, as you can see, you've got the nice clip over another, and the friend's face is blurred. Now, when you get to this part, it's nice because you can do your final kind of adjustments and touches to it. Because now you can see the blur over the image, so you can do your adjustments right like that to make it perfect. So now what we're going to do is to show it to you, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to render. Which is the biggest pain about video editing without a doubt, but it's something that has to be done. So I'll just give it about 15 seconds and then we can see our final results. Okay, so now I'm going to go ahead and just play the video clip for you and then you will... Uh, see that it came out quite nicely. So, face on the right is blurred, the rest of the frame is still intact without any sort of distortion. So, hope this tutorial was helpful, and uh, subscribe if you want to. Thanks.